Hi friends, my name is Haruka and I'm a virtual coach for college admissions. Today, I wanna to know if there are any high school students out there who want to know about the five stages in every student's college admissions journey. So college is one of the most important decisions that uh, you're gonna make in your lifetime. It is a transition period uh, from, you know, you from your teenage years to young adulthood and college really sets you on the course for the rest of your life. So it's really important that you take this process very seriously and give it thought as well as spend um, some time doing, um, doing it right. And college admissions is not an event, it's actually a process. And like any process, you have to uh, divide it up and take it stage by stage. The first of the five stages is self-discovery. When I work with my students, I always uh, take a very student-centered approach because every student is different. Every student has uh, you know, their own academic record, uh, whatever it is, they have strengths, weaknesses, they have, you know, skills and interests. All of these things combined, um, you have to, you have to understand it, you know, know thyself. That's what self-discovery is all about. The second stage is called college exploration. Um, it's all about research because there are 4,000 schools in the United States and you have to understand that, you know, there's a school out there for you. And there's a difference, right? They're not just uh, names. They're, there's, you, you need to understand the differences between say a California school and an out-of-state school. Uh, what is the difference between uh, a UC and a CSU. What are the differences of all the UCs? Um, what is the difference between a college and a university? Um, what are the advantages of going to an out-of-state school? What are Ivy League colleges like or universities like? Um, all of these, you know, all of these schools are different. Every school has a pro and a con and understanding what, uh, you know, what it is in a college that is gonna be um, best for you, that, that requires research. Even um, research about financial fit is also important because every school has a price tag and you have to be, uh, keep it real, make sure you understand how much your family can afford. Um, it is, uh, you know, process to understand the cost of attendance. And that again is, requires research. Um, all of um, research requires that you have an open heart and open mind, especially if you want to find the gems out there. Um, you know, take the time to do it right. Stage three is called focus because, um, you know, in the beginning, you're, you're, you're exploring a lot, but at the end of the day, you need to narrow down the school so that you can build your own customized list. Um, in the beginning, you may have a lot of preferences, right? Preferences about big schools or small schools or schools that you may be familiar with because some friends or family went there. Um, but through the process of researching through, say, websites, or reference books, or different um, um, cost calculators, you know, visiting schools, going on information sessions, college fairs. Um, after all of that, you'll be able to uh, build a list of requirements, right? All the preferences will become requirements. Uh, you'll have requirements uh, based on your academic, social, and financial fit uh, criteria. And that will anchor you as you build your college list. Um, how big is the college list? Well, that's a really good question. But I think a rule of thumb would be UCs, CSUs, um, at least one tag, you know, tr uh, uh, community college uh, tag uh, um, school as well as uh, six others, right? 
So if you can build that list together, that is, um, that's the goal. Stage, five, stage four is the application process. Um, once you've built the list, you need to actually do it, right? It's execution here. Um, so understanding um, what all of the deadlines are and trying to understand what's the sequence, right? You wanna know which ones to do first because if you have, say, 10 schools you want to apply to, you wanna know, you, you have to have a reason for uh, submitting certain applications first and others second, third, fourth, whatever. You wanna make sure that you have a schedule that's reasonable that you can manage and you want to make sure that you meet all of your deadlines so um, and it's not just the applications applications have essays um, supplemental essays you'll have um, financial aid forms the FAFSA the CSS profile so that whole application process takes place um, in fall of senior year um, and that is really stage four the final stage is evaluation, stage five. Um, after, um, you know, after the winter, you, you'll have a little waiting period and you'll get the results, the decisions from your schools. You're gonna get two decisions, right? From every school, you're gonna get um, a response from the admissions office and then you're also gonna get the financial aid office. You don't want to ignore the financial aid package because a lot of families these days um, cost does matter right let's keep it real so you you know it is very possible that you get you can um, you know in an ideal situation you can get into your reach school but sometimes you may not be able to afford the your reach school so or maybe it would be a stretch you know you have to make some decisions as to how much uh, your family is willing and able to afford um, once you get those um, results in so evaluation is um, the process of comparing all of the admissions decisions of um, analyzing the financial aid letter understanding where you can getting you know what, what schools give you money and and, and um, whether it's need based or or merit aid based um, and then coming up with your final decision right um, so that's it those are the five stages of the every student's college admissions journey right first is self-discovery second is college exploration third is focus fourth is application, and fifth is evaluation. Um, if you work with me uh, as your virtual college coach, I'll help you go through these stages of the college admissions journey. I'm going to be launching um, a webinar series called College Knowledge, and if uh, we'll be going through many of these uh, stages and covering a lot of deep dive topics. Take a look at my website, planeteducation.com, and um, register if you'd like. Um, I'll be starting them on Thursday, January 23rd from 4 to 5 p.m. Pacific time. Uh, every hour you'll be educated, inspired, and motivated to work on your college journey. All right, have a great day. Bye.